fellow space engineers. Well, it's time for another episode. So I've been doing some stuff around here on the ship. I'm just gonna kinda show you what's been going on. I kinda painted my entire vehicle. Uh, I think I did. Oh no, almost. <laughs> Let's do some more here. No, I basically painted my entire vehicle here. Uh, have to have there we go and I think it's looking pretty cool got hit by the thrusters there I keep forgetting about that and there we go that's yellow so this is the ship oh yeah see I've been mining these and I had a little incident so oh crap so now um, let's grind this by hand. Yeah, um, I was using the grinder, and I've been taking apart this one ship here. Um, I keep saying um, it really bugs me. <laughs> but anyways, so yeah, I've been taking apart this, this ship here, and it fell apart on me. Um, I took out some major components because I was thinking that this thing could handle. But when it's directly connected to an inventory box, it doesn't automatically empty it. So when I go into here, let's see here. Yeah, see? Oh, wait. Grinder. It's empty now. Well, because you can access and move things, but it wasn't emptying into here when I was using the grinder. And it was getting annoying, so I think I need a conveyor in between the box and the, the actual grinder. So I think that's an issue there. I'm not sure if that's intentional, but I'll have to do that. This works fine because it's directly attached to the, the conveyor, and then it goes from there. So, yeah, I'm thinking it has to, to do something with the conveyor, I believe. Because this stuff will empty and will go into the refinery. If the refinery is full, it will dump into the box. So I've seen it done that. So I don't know. Uh, yeah, let's pick up some components here. Right here. It's thruster components, I think. Yeah. Okay, where did those plates go? What's this? Motors. Yeah, see, this is just a few pieces that have, uh, were getting away on me. It's, it's frustrating in that sense. <laughs> so, yeah, so, um, the intention of the video today wasn't all this, all this distraction here. Um, uh, the intention was to say that, hey, you know, I have, have this mining ship here that I'm going to test drive. Um, I'm going to show, explain why I'm going to design a new one. Uh, just there's issues. So, but anyways, this I'm going to have to redo. So I'm going to take this out. Uh, and then I'm going to probably recreate the back end here. Maybe even take out these here. This one and this one. Um, and, uh... I'll probably create like three of them all connected by conveyors into this same system for this. And then, yeah, then I'll leave enough room to be empty stuff into here. And you know, to have a bank of these at the back here, so that way I can grind up all this, uh, all this stuff here. I want to collect it all, but I need to automate it more. So I think the conveyor will help me do that. Uh, I need to put this away. So yeah, so uh, let's be, let me put all this stuff away here first. Yeah, you're going to see everything that I do, so bear with me. If you don't like it, don't watch. <laughs> Otherwise, keep on watching. So this stuff is going to drift, so I need to take care of this. And we're still using realistic settings. This is daily life, back and forth, back and forth. This is why I put the box on the top of the ship here. 
for exactly this problem. I guess I could have left this, but we should be able to fit it all in, in the inventory. I do have plans on building more stuff. Just because it, I think it's pretty cool. On my last video, I believe I didn't, I didn't have the station ready, or did I? Ah, oh, anyways, there's a beacon, a station that has a beacon, and or not station, but a little kind of <laughs> you know, cockpit with a beacon on it. So yeah, so oh, what's this? I forgot about this. Okay. Oh, crap. Anyways. So yeah, I'm trying to focus here, I'm getting distracted. You guys are probably having a good laugh, it's pretty funny. <laughs> so let's pick this up here. Oh yeah, it's just metal grids. There we go. Okay, I think that's pretty much everything. Uh, I shouldn't be drifting. That was just the part that fell off from the large storage container. Okay, so let's get a move on here. Where are we going to go to mine? Let's pick up a, a pl uh, place. I'm going to turn around and I'm going to pick back here. So I will come back once we get to that destination. Alright, perfect. Uh, in the meantime, though, I'm going to input some footage here. Uh, it's going to be about, I'm trying to remember, is when I went and uh, captured a ship, I... I recorded the whole process, so I'm going to put some music to that, and yeah, and so here you go. Enjoy.
Okay, well, here we are. So, what are we gonna do? Yeah, I have auto save enabled, so <laughs> hopefully we don't mess up too badly. Let's see here. Okay, so in here with my ship, as you saw a moment ago, there's some uranium directly under here. I forgot to turn the gravity on. Let me turn that, oh, did they fix this? Huh? Wow, let's try this. That's a surprise. Oh, 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 yay, 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 look at that. <laughs> Doors work again. Sweet. Okay, there we go. This is why I have doors. Um, I, I, I just love them. I, I love how they look. I love how they work. Uh, it's just amazing. Okay, so that conveyor system will be put in. Oh, it's so great. I'm getting disorientated. I need the gravity generator on. So let's turn that on. Um, okay, I need to get in here. Okay. Gravity generator on. So the cool thing with the gravity generators is depending on how you have them situated, they'll create a gravity field going down from where your the, the, the gravity well is. So... I think that is pretty amazing. So, you'll watch. Uh, jetpack. Now, see, I got gravity. But when I first came here, from way over there, the graveyard, um, I had to, I had to uh, rotate because this was actually above me. So now it's below me. And let's turn jetpack on here. So now the fun part will be to. A dock or you undock and fly with my mining ship and you can see why in a moment here why it's not oh did they fix those I was in the cockpit but it wasn't uh, maybe I don't know maybe things are fixed with this maybe it updated but I was reading there was no update notes but hey so basically this is its parking spot uh, let's turn this on why Let's the landing gear, I think is P. Yeah, okay, okay. Now the thing with thrusters is they can damage other ships. So you need to be very careful. Turn off inertial dampeners, just tap the F. And as you'll see, see it's not damaged. So you just gotta tap it very, very lightly. So just, just enough. And then once we're high enough, we can kind of there we go, increase it. So, you're gonna see how this baby works. Uh, it's an air stampers on, okay. So right below the ship here, let's see. I should be able to get at it. I'm gonna try and mine the rock here. Uh, let's see here. I might have hit my ship, I'm not very good at this. Ah, here we go. So I'm looking for uranium. So we're gonna try mining with this, see what happens. Let's see. Huh, okay, no, maybe it's not. Let's see if we change the view. Okay, well, let's see if we can get to the uranium that's behind all this stuff. Conveyors sh should be operating. Now the thing with the gravity is I'm letting it see where it's collecting. That was the plan. The plan was to to have it collect. Hey, and then I was going to do this. I was going to pull the ship out. See where it's collecting. It's pretty cool. And I was going to hop out. And I was going to pick up the leftover bits because this is a lot of waste. Uh, do I need stone per se? Not really. I don't think I do. I'm not sure. I know you use it for building components, but let's just do it for, for completion sakes here just to have it to make sure we got it. So the point, uh, the point I'm doing here is I'm digging down to this is actually a lot that's wasted 
how much is on the ship? So we're going to look at what's in the ship here, because out of curiosity. i go like this. Uh, there's 338 stone in the cargo container. Medium cargo container, small. Uh, oh, so the drills did extract it. That's interesting. See? So I collected quite a bit of stone. <laughs> okay. Let's pop that in there. Okay, well, yeah, so this is what I was going to do, just mine. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry on mining with this. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. I have, I can have a thousand objects in the world, so let's just do this. Uh, T. Let's see if we destroy any parts of the ship. Uranium, okay. Oh, uh, I want to go up, up. Like this forward because yeah. this is this is the plan oh yeah okay see what the problem is so you have to dig down here too so you can get it at this stuff. Okay. Oh. I want to see if we can make it down to the the uranium here. I love that though, that idea. Just uh, the fact that... There we go. Oh, look, that looks so amazing. We're almost at the uranium. Backwards, yeah, this is backwards. Let's, uh, let's see what we look like here. So the ship is still intact. So, because I'm worried about those thrusters. If you can see the thrusters on top, they're a bit high. And then the conveyor system. So if I knock out those thrusters, uh, well, I got two. Yeah, I guess I got two down there. I'm just kind of thinking if I had to move the ship all of a sudden. Yeah, that's like another thing is you need enough thrusters to have good maneuverability. And, and uh, so, yeah, so this design, uh, I'm going to call this the grasshopper. <laughs> yeah, here, might as well take a screenshot right here while we're in the game. Do this, do this. And, uh, perfect, there we go. Screenshot taken. Uh, that was kind of interesting. So let's carry on with this. Let's see if we can get down to the payload there. This is the point of this. Yeah, up here a bit. Just making sure I got enough space for it all. Look at that. We're getting closer. Uh, oh, oh. Some stuff is being released. All right, let's take a look at the ship here quickly. Uh, everything looks still intact. Okay, so we'll have to make sure we move this over a bit. I'll go backwards a bit. Up, up, up. Okay, look at that. That's actually looking quite nicely here. Let's go up here. Let's see what we. Okay, that's good. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry on. I'm going to start, actually the uranium's down here, isn't it? Look at that. Yeah, no, we're hitting it already. This is right here. Excellent. So I will pick all this up and I'll continue digging and I'm going to show you what all happens. Alrighty, perfect. So we'll be right back here. So welcome back. See, as you can see, I was mining. I dug a bunch of stuff. Now it's time to, to put it away. Um, this is getting quite full, I think. Let me take a quick uh, peek here. Uh, oops. Inventory. Uh, yeah, that, see, look at that 8,000. I put some steel plates in there that I had. So now basically the drills are filling up. So I'm going to dump this stuff. 
I'm gonna put this in the drills. So I could keep drilling, but I've been running into issues. And my issues are to do with with the, you know, these thrusters here. It's exactly as I thought it was going to be. But if you look down here, you know, they're going to hit along the top here. So I need to carve out the area a little bit more, or I need to build a better, more compact ship. And I think that's what's going to happen. And then, and before, I think the reason my my drills were getting destroyed was because of the thrusters there in the front. So yeah. So anyways, I'll show you what happens once we're done doing what we're doing. So say you're done mining. So I'll show you what, what, what we do now. So now we need to line up with our ship. Let's see here. There we go. So that yellow area is to let me know where roughly where I need to line up with. Then we come in here. Uh, we need to line up a couple different ways. So let's get closer. Okay. I think we need to angle up more. Yeah, angle up more. And then we need to angle to. So we need to roll to the right. Here we go. Uh, let's see how we are. Angle up a bit more. There we go. Push V to get in. V. Okay. Let's zoom out a bit. So now we're going to come down. I think we're over that. Are we over the target? Not quite. So we're going to get over the target, which is like that. And then we're going to go down towards it. Let's see. Just needs. Ooh. Okay, perfect. So let's see here. I almost went too close. Ooh, almost destroyed that. Let's turn dampers on again. Let's come back down. There we go. So let's move it up a bit. There we go. So I think we're ready to just tab a bit more. So there we go. See, so aim. Everything's looking good. Let's turn that stuff on. Watch this. We go on and on. Uh, watch, boom, boom, out it goes. It's dumping everything, it's collecting, the conveyors are collecting everything, and that will happen for a while, and it is pretty cool. And what I'll do is I'll come back about when I, I start building the new ship. So I'm going to fly back to the graveyard there and uh, show you what I've done once I've, I've gotten there and established something. So yeah, so I'll be back shortly. Okay, and here's the final segment that we're going to continue with. Okay, welcome back, everybody. <clears throat> so, what I've done, um, I've I flew back here from where we were mining. I think down there or well, somewhere. Anyways, uh, and so you know, after I flew back, I I dumped the ship. As you saw, of course, and then, and then, or so after I dumped the ship, I, I landed it. I flew back here. That's the story. I'm getting mixed up. <laughs> and uh, then I decide to add these. If you notice that they're all accessible from the outside here, which then, if you go into here, for example, if I click and drag this, uh, ah, there we go all these containers are active and available. Isn't that amazing? So that means that's connected. Right now the grinders are empty. They don't, uh, you hold too much. They only hold about 2,500 liters or 2,500 yeah, liters. So we're going to tear apart this ship. Oh, and there's the, the thruster again. So I do it all the time. I'm going to have to to design my ships a little bit better with the thrusters, but that's okay. This is the first uh, large ship. So we're going to give this a shot here. See uh, how it goes. Okay. I, I'm pressing the mouse button. I think it's activated. Let's see. Yeah, you can see him turning. So let's see what we can do here. 
Uh, dun, dun, dun. It's like a prana. Oh. oh, oh, hopefully it pops. There we go. So the experiment is to see if if anything falls off. It, um, if the panels are starting to float away, then I'll be very disappointed. But we're gonna see what goes on here. Uh, okay, good, good, good. Okay. So, let's see, inventory. Where's the grinders? Oh, well, look at that. So, where is this stuff being dumped? Huh. Okay. So this is working, so that's the trick, the conveyors. You can't directly connect these to the the inventory boxes. You need a conveyor in between the grinders and the inventory. Okay, so that's cool. I'm okay with that. Oh well, I'm just gonna randomly dump stuff everywhere. It's probably this stuff here. So that means let's carry on with the next piece. And uh, let's do this. Okay, cool. Huh. So it's working out much better than I expected. So it should take all the everything inside of it. Let's see if we can do it. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> right on. Okay, so this is working out quite good. Saved, good, good, good. Let's see what happens here. If anything falls out, I'll be disappointed. Still takes a long time. Oh, look at that. Looky, looky. Sweet. Oh, ho, ho, ho. wow. Well, so there you have it, everyone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to carry on grinding these ships apart. And we're going to see how many I can grind through before I fill up. And then when I fill up, we're going to deal with that. I think that's going to be the plan. So all you space engineers out there, Thank you for watching, and I've, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Um, I'm trying my best to try and figure out how to make these interesting. Um, I figure I'll just show what I do, and hopefully that's what's interesting. So, yeah. So, all of you have a great day, and I'll see you in the next episode here.